hello viewers and not just my viewers but um gd community i guess i just wanted to make this video because i felt like when i beat it i learned how to get consistent at every single part little parts of level so um i wanted to make this video to help people out that just started this level because it's extreme there's an extreme amount of hype around it and it's a really good level and i feel like i maybe genuinely could help some people so i'm gonna see if i can try and help with every single little part of this you gotta get used to hearing my practice song sorry and also please note that i'm playing with an ldm so i'm not playing full deep uh, full um detail version well okay at this start there is a lot of things you just gotta learn about this level like just this first part just learn it um i guess the first little thing you can note is there um i suggest jumping quite early she just hit it a little bit early and then here i spam for the most part i, I may be hit a little bit late there but that doesn't really matter so early and spam and then hit the red orb get used to hitting it correctly then this you just gotta learn and this wave you gotta learn here though um don't jump too high up don't go like up here just go just, you can you can just have a lot of space to not go too far up if you get what i mean like uh, as i'm showing you there you don't have to go fully up the next thing this orb um, the other ones you can just hit, but this or, um, you gotta hold it a little bit, cause if you just hit it, you're gonna hit the top spike, or it's, okay, I didn't dare, but you, there's a chance you will, if you're not set correctly, like that, and the red orb hit it in the middle, cause else you're gonna hit the saw, at the, the small saw, and this, um, UFO timing, you just gotta get used to it. And actually this spam, I recommend not spamming too fast. For some people I can mess it up spamming too fast, but it doesn't really matter that much. Okay, well, we're at the drop now. Um, so here, at the drop, the first little thing you just learn it here. But at the UFO there, that, it, that could be a little bit tricky to learn. So what I do is I click one, two, one, three, one. That's basically what I do. I can show you again. It goes a little bit fast, but one, two, one, two, three, one, and then spam. Then actually, I don't think this matters either, but I hit that one a little teeny bit late and then hit that one very quickly. So I do like, wait, hold on. I do very fast clicks. And then it, it for me, it works good. I can maybe start here. That works for me. On this ship, I just do a light tap and then one more extremely light tap. And please remember that this wave is reverse. One, just light tap and extremely light tap and then spam the UFO. Okay, I went a little bit too far there. Um, these blue orbs are extremely annoying. You gotta hit them very early, like earlier than you think. Oh, so just hit them extremely early. And here, you actually don't have to hit that green orb. Oh, there. Right there, as you can see. Um, You can just hit the, the black orb and the red orb. And it'll take you imme immediately to the next part. Wait, early, early, hit, hit. And then, yeah. It's way easier to do it that way instead of hitting the green orb. Okay, here. Hit maybe the red orb there. <laughs> not as far as you hit it but basically just when you land so just make sure you land before you hit it okay this part this is a one of the first hard parts um remember you gotta hold here so you both jump with the top and bottom one but just look at the top cube at first so Remember, this blue orb, there's nothing that you can, like, hit. There's not a block, so you don't have the time. You just have it to hit it immediately. Um, so, hit it immediately. And then, you go into that gravity portal. And you can actually, once you're through that gravity portal, hit that immediately. But it goes really fast, so you gotta take care of not 
jumping on that block and hitting that spike. And then you just gotta like two immediate clicks. And here, click once and then time that green orb as early as possible, this green orb. So you click once and then as early as possible. And you don't have to hit the blue orb at all. It works. And then there's a little bit of fake, you don't have to go there, just clear gear. You gotta go up through those blocks. Um, this is also probably the hardest part, but those two hit them really early. And then, um, the, the block at here, um, it's hard to show, but right there, where you gotta jump there, you gotta, gotta wait a little bit, but don't hit it too late. Better to hit it too early than too late. Just make sure you don't hit that spike, but if you hit it too late, um, you're gonna hit that spike. So you gotta hit it pretty early. And then here, make sure you hit that platform before you click. And then once you've hit the platform, click two times very fast. So click and then hold. Like, look, so hit hold, and then it works. Hit hold and make sure you hit the platform. It's very important. Because if you don't hit the platform, it might bug out. Yeah, like that. So hit the platform and then it works. And you gotta get used to timing this yellow orb late. That one right there. You gotta get used to timing it late. This is pretty straight up forward with the arrows. Um, then there comes a the very hard UFO part. This one. Okay, so this UFO part. You can actually get consistent at it. You just gotta practice it. So try to hit the yellow orb as immediately as possible, and then line yourself up with these portals. So you like wait a little bit here, and then try and kind of line yourself up with the portals, like you saw I did there. So you don't hit all hit them all late, because that doesn't work. But try to hit only the first one late, and then line yourself up the portals. And then when you come to this ban, I can set a checkpoint there you gotta click once and then click twice and then you gotta wait till you, you're up there for you click again and then you're actually can get past the spam consistently so once twice once once twice once still a little bit hard but it's way better than any other way that I've found so I recommend using this strongly like that okay I don't know it can apparently die to that orb then the ending should be very, very straightforward. Just, you can hit that green orb as early as possible. And you gotta, no, you just gotta remember that that's a UFO. You gotta be prepared for that jump. But if you're prepared, you should be good. And just hit all of these as early as possible. And maybe this one, don't just, I don't like to spam right away. I like to go a little bit down, but it, it doesn't matter that much. Well. That is my walkthrough tutorial. And oh, guess what? It matches with the practice song. That's perfect. Now you can hear the song is almost at the end. I would also recommend you that you go watch um, YouTube videos, maybe at um, 25 speed. You can watch mine if you want. Um, I'll leave a link in the description to my completion of me beating Liak. This is my first extreme demon, even though I do think this deserves an insane demon, without a doubt. Well, I hope this video helped you, and I hope that you can get way more consistent at the level. Because I feel like I can get consistent at every part. But, that's basically it. So, um, goodbye.